Uh, the back-to-back -back losses to Pomona, I mean, has it been a long uh, time off? Do you think it was a chance for the players just to kind of, you know, kind of maybe regroup during the, the little break before you guys uh, get back to conference play? Yeah, it's always nice to go on a break after a win, that's, that's for sure, but um, Pomona's a really tough team. You know, they're the best team we've, we've seen this year, and um, we were able to hang with them both games and, and had opportunities to win on both occasions. So. We have to take that, um, you know, remember those positives and, and um, you know, keep moving forward. And, and it just seems like we, you know, right when we get started, we have we had a break over Thanksgiving, and then we got back into it, and now we have another break. And so we're uh, trying to get regroup again for our, what would be our third phase, I guess. Yeah, for the first uh, two months, November, December, what have you learned about this uh, Jacks team? Uh, it's a really, a really fun group. I, I really enjoy uh, coaching them. They. Um, are very unselfish. They they play together. They are genuinely um, you know happy when when their teammates succeed and and they want it, want to do well. And so I think those traits will help us continue to get better from this point forward. And, and it just makes for you know a nice uh, a nice team to coach and a nice uh, program to be around. Uh, you guys go on the road. <clears throat> excuse me. Go on the road this week at Monterey Bay and East Bay, the Bays. Uh, talk about uh, Monterey. Um, Monterey has has a, a good core group back from last year's team that was very successful. You know they lost some some of their um, firepower, but they have a good core back and and they haven't you know landed on the win column in the in conference and, and they're a good team and it just goes to show you you know looking at our record as well you know it, it's it, I don't think that we're a one and three team but somebody has to lose those games you know everybody can't have a winning record and so. I think Monterey is similar in that regard. That they're good. They they can play. They know how to win. They can shoot the ball very well. Um, and you know we need to make sure that, that we're prepared to uh, you know for battle down there on Friday. Obviously, um, you know you want to even that conference record. You're even better. You guys uh, get to come home next week. But uh, uh, what would you like to accomplish uh, this weekend? Um, it's. It's all about us getting back to uh, game speed and playing shape, you know, those days off, the, the mandated week off um, that the NCAA um, enforces is, is tough this time of year when, when you're, you know, in your playing shape. And, and so um, this week we want to continue to uh, move forward with that, you know, getting our game speed, get our rhythm going, to get, get our, um, you know, style back and, and uh, um, you know, continue to battle on the defensive end. That's something that we are continually trying to improve. Is uh, you know, getting stops and rebounds and forcing teams into into uh, making having to make shots and, and uh, not giving them anything too easy. You know, it's still early in the conference season, but do you feel like with this Jacks team, the best is yet to come as you guys move forward in the conference play? Um, I think so. I, we you know we we started out with a couple close wins early in the year and and. Um, you know, start out with a pretty strong as far as record goes, and now we've had some setbacks. But I think that that we're, we will continue to get better, and, and we hopefully we'll be playing our best uh, here down the stretch. I ask you this every year about New Year's resolutions. Oh gosh, you do. I so. might never have one. Uh, <laughs> I didn't even know it was New Year's Eve. We uh, <laughs> we were looking at the dates. We were like, oh my gosh, we're just so focused on basketball. So it's always you know, get healthy, make sure we're uh, exercising and. Um, eating right. Perfect, perfect. And can you just touch a little bit about, um, you touched on um, playing Monterey Bay, but can you just talk, touch a little bit about playing East Bay too? Yeah. Um, they're, you know, a really good team in the conference right now. Can you just talk to me a little bit about facing them? Yeah, we were able to see East Bay at the um, CCA Pac West Challenge early in the year, and I think they're really good. They're one, of, I, I feel like they're one of the top teams in the conference. They uh, have, you know, every dimension that, that you want in a team. They have really strong post play. Their post two posts lead them in scoring and um, but they're surrounded by very good and, and uh, veteran guards that have been in this been in the league for years. You know, they Susie brought in freshmen and have developed them and a couple of them have been player of the year freshmen of the year um, and now they're juniors and seniors and so you know they have some really strong guards and, and so it's you know, they're a tough mix and, and East Bay um, plays a matchup zone that, that you don't see very often and um, it, it gets you out of your rhythm and um, forces you to uh, you know, play it, play play a different style on offense, and so they, they do a very good job with that. So I think that you know they're going to be tough. You know, we haven't won down there in a few years, so we're we're fired up to try to take that challenge on. 
And um, you also mentioned, you know, you, with these games this weekend, you kind of just want to get back into shape, you know, after the, the couple of long layoffs um, in between playing. Um, but, I mean, is the goal to kind of come back up here, um, come back home with two wins? Um, we always, you know, every weekend we, we expect to win, we prepare to win, and, um, you know, we, we're not happy if, if we don't. And so, you know, obviously the every every game we, um, you know, that's the goal is to, to come up with Ws. I think we're capable. I think we could um, go in there and, and um, knock both teams off, but very, you know, easily could lose both. You know, they're both good teams, so there's never a game in this conference that, can take lightly, and um, I think that our team can compete with everybody in top to bottom, and, and we have to, but you have to prove it on the court, and, and you can't just expect to uh, walk in and, and get, have anything happen to you.